Ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back. We are here in the Trey Kent channel for more WWE 2K20. My career. This is chapter two. This is episode two. So get ready. It is time to see what AJ Styles is up to, including Natalia. I still can't believe it's really all over for you and Red. I know. It is starting to sink in, though. Just this morning, I was thinking about that time we faced each other in a Falls Count Anywhere match. Man, that was brutal. Hold on, time out. I just realized something. This muff is not even moving. Yeah, but thanks to you in that match, now every time my jaw hurts, I know it's gonna rain. Really? Maybe you should get that checked out. No way. You might be the champ who runs the camp, but I'm the champ who knows when it's damp. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't quite have the same ring to it. Play the match. Don't play the match. Hmm. Ugh. Side missions, man. Side missions. But you know what? Hey, pull that match up on your phone if you don't mind. Looks like we're going to play the match. I think it's between me and uh, Styles and the Fosca Anywhere. So yes, this time you can hear better audio, just like in the last clip of the video that happened in episode one. So this time there will be no echoes. Besides entrances, you might hear echoes because I like hearing entrances throughout the video. Oh boy. Chapter one was very confusing. Want to make a pay for or submission? Okay. Ah, I keep forgetting it's triangle. Got used to the to the new controls, man. Oh God. Oh. Well, I can't count him. I am the former Universal Champion. What the fuck? AJ Styles, and Trey Wolves. What the hell? I just realized. This is after Mania. No, you not. Oh, boy. God damn million dollar tower last year with a fluke. Scam. Uh oh. Oh no, he's doing my taunt. Oh no. What? Pick up a reverse button one real quick. Hey, you're right. Nothing is well off limits. Real quick, in case we have any newbies watching. Haha. -ha. Anywhere match means that this contest can literally end anywhere. Simple, right? Even Saxton can understand those rules. Oh, again! Oh, it shows no mercy. And that poor chair. No, 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 no. I ain't done. Doing some more damage. <laughs> I am not done. Counter, damn it. About time. Oh, by the way, ladies and gentlemen, this is on Legend. Just so you know. If y'all think I'm putting this on easy, I ain't no 10 year old kid. Y'all bugging. This ain't nothing to me. <laughs> I'm just spamming. That's all I'm doing. Just spamming chair shots. Right, you know, I'm going to let him go. I'll wait for him to get in. Oh, 
Wait for it. What the hell? What are you doing? Oh, wait a second. What am I doing? Perhaps he's thinking the ring can't contain what he has in mind here. I can't get him? The fuck? Why can't I get him? Oh, there we go. Weapon snapper. Good night. Good night. Just give him the TK Slender, yo. It's a wrap. Oh, he kicked out. That's all those chair shots. This is crazy. Well, back to the chest we go. <laughs> yo, this is messed up, yo. Oh! You counted this time. Nope. Yeah. No, he's buffed. He can't counter. What the hell? I just did a fucking cutter. Ooh, that ended the match. I wouldn't mind. I would not mind. By the way, I keep forgetting to turn up the commentary. Uh-oh. There we go again. Oh, you're not. Oh! Uh oh, I can't count it this time. I gotta wait. Just waiting for it to get yellow. That is not my finisher. Here we go. Ah, oh, man. Damn. He counted it too, man. Oh! Holy crap. I'm gonna beat up. Aha. Oh man. I pressed the damn freaking triangle button. Yo, 2K. Yo, the YouTubers was right about these. They hit the tension and all that, son. In the world. Oh my god, I can't even pick it up. Oh, there we go. Yo, you tell me I can't get inside the ring with the weapon, yo? The hell? Alright, it has to be over. It has to be over. What the hell? There's no blood on his head. There we go. Oh my god, that generic theme song. Y'all can't hear it, but I don't like that theme song. What the hell? Let's watch again how AJ Styles is toppled tonight. He's getting after it here. These guys are yeah, the flashes in this match. The flashes are the ones that set the world on fire. As these highlights Kids. show very well. An amazing contest comes to a close following a decisive pinfall victory. I'm not impressed at all by AJ Styles' effort tonight. Well, I mean, he tried. I don't think anybody would have expected anything all right, from all match right. here at Extreme Rules. That Holy crap. I'm hearing the Dirt theme song by Wally Crew. To be honest, that's, the, that's only the best song throughout the whole playlist. My goodness.
Well, that's about it. I just wanted to congratulate you, Red. You really deserve this. Thanks, Natty. I know we had some differences over the years, but we always worked them out in the ring. Yeah, except that one time we got into it backstage. Uh-oh. <laughs> I forgot about that. I didn't. You threw me into a road case. What the hell? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. What were we even fighting about? The usual stuff. Who was better, the title, you saying you were the best female superstar to ever come out of Calgary. Come out. She's Canadian? What the fuck? I put her in fucking Manhattan, New York. That's right. Now I remember. I know I'm not talking about freaking Natalia. I'm talking about Red. Anyway, let's just play the match. Things have clearly gotten personal. Uh oh, uh oh, oh. There we go. Ooh, that was a hard kick. She was the best female superstar to ever come out of Calgary. That was pretty much a direct shot at Natty. Natalia is certainly proud of her legacy and will go to any lengths to defend it. Damn, right on the wall. Evading possible disaster there. Oh. Yet another no way, no way. It's like they're both somehow one step ahead of each other. When you look at this, it looks like they both did their homework heading into this one. Oh, oh. Who's that over there, Dan Bryant? In the back? Oh, right on the road case. Holy crap. I oh, don't know, you is not taking me to the office. Or locker room. Oh, no, that's, yeah, that's the locker room. Natalia's a third generation superstar and extremely competent, but pedigree and confidence can only get you so far in WWE, especially in a match like this. <laughs> what does Natalia have to do here to pull out the win? What the hell was that? Obvious. Natalia's best strategy has to be soften her opponent's back. What in the hell? Uh, okay, that, that okay. All right, 2K, y'all better fix these, these glitches, yo. Let's see how the, let's see how the parking lot is, you know? I don't know why the environment looks like this. It looks like it's freaking. Oh! <laughs> oh, okay. It's the same shit. But very, very. Just just a little different. Just a little different. Just the truck. The, the truck is the only one. Everything is just remaining the same. What the? I did not say. Oh my. Is that a motorcycle? Oh no, that, that's not a motorcycle. Oh my god. Changes her fortune there. I like parking lot balls better. An impressive series of moves. Gives me more space. Like oh! Ah! Oh! Jeez! Oh my goodness! She Golly! The favor there. She's in control. Okay. Angle, That's a hard ass sense. power slam, yo. I got room by knockout. The the fuck? Big time oh, I got a signature. Reef. I just realized. Setting up for it. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Come on. Can I counter? <laughs> yes. Well, Thank you. Uh, Here we go. It's about that time, gentlemen. This is for Adam Cole. Oh, damn. That knocked that out right there. She's getting up from that one. Damn. Hey, it's X Pac. Just keep hey. watching. We don't have time. We always have time for X Pac. Besides, you can't just ignore a WWE Hall of Famer. I can. Trey. Pac, what's going on? Hey, guys. Looking good. You too. Thanks. I'm on this new mustard only diet. As in, mustard is the only condiment you use? No. As in, I only eat mustard. I've already dropped like seven pounds. The hell? That's interesting. But enough about me. This is your big night. I swear it was just like yesterday when I first saw you two on the indie scene. Yeah, at that point we were only a couple years in. And I was about 30 years in. But I could still go today if I had to. I'm telling you, this diet's legit. I guess you could say you can cut the mustard, huh? What? Anyway, we wouldn't be here today if it wasn't for you. So, thanks. I'm sure you'd have been fine with it without my help. Trey, I don't think I can say the same for you. 
You were kind of the drizzling craps back then. No offense. No, it's true. And I wasn't just a drizzle. I was more like a torrential downpour of crap. Red was always ahead of me from the moment we started training. Well, damn. This goes way back. And they couldn't put this as a storyline first? <laughs> Last year's my career? Because I'm still a little confused. Like, originally in the other my career, he was by himself. But now in this my career, he's with her. You can use this credit card for whatever you need, but we keep the reward points. I'm about 10,000 short of a free trip to someplace warm, and you're gonna help me get there. Deal? Got it. We are gonna miss oh. you so much. When did you get there? I just had to be close to you one more time. It, it feels like yesterday we got that call. There was a boy in Denver who was ready to be adopted, and now you're all grown up and going off to college. I, I, I just can't believe it. <laughs> I know. It's hard for me to believe, too. We'll come visit soon, okay? No, don't. I mean... A big part of college is learning independence, and if you're visiting all the time, then I'll never be able to do that. Just be smart about the credit card, okay? Like, if there's a big keg party, put it all on the card and have everyone pay you back in cash. That way, I'll be headed for that free beach trip in no time. Hey, maybe we could go on spring break together. Frank? I have to go. Yeah, I wouldn't do okay. that. Okay, drive safe. This is the part where you get out of the car. <laughs> right. Call us when you get to school. We love you, Denver! Alright, so basically, in this age of what's happening, he just turned 18. So, fast forward to the Hall of Fame, I'm guessing he's like probably 43 or 42. I'm, I, I think, I don't know. I don't know. So, this is very confusing. I like the mind career so far, but it's very confusing. Do you believe this? We're finally doing it. Our very first list item. Train at the dungeon. Are you excited as I am? I don't think that's possible considering you've already had three energy drinks before we've even left town. <laughs> but this is gonna be cool. I know. Think about how many top superstars came through Calgary. The Hearts, Edge, Jake the Snake Roberts, Rowdy Roddy Piper, and we're next. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. We have a long way to go before we can be mentioned in the same sentence as those legends. Everyone has to start somewhere though, right? And the dungeon is a great place to start. I still can't believe your parents were okay with all this. What happened to them wanting you to go to college? They changed their minds. Just like that? Just like that. Huh. Okay. Well, that's good. Hey, pull over real quick. Bathroom break already? No, I want to show you something. See that sign? Our faces are going to be on it someday. You really think we can become more famous than the inventor of the paper toilet seat cover? <laughs> Put a lot of butts in seats. <laughs> and when we make it to WWE, so will we. I mean, it could happen. But to be honest, it did happen because it's showing the future from the Hall of Fame and it's showing the past. It's going back and forth. Holy crap, this reminds me of the TV show Arrow when you're in the present and then they give you a flashback in the show. Oh, what the hell? Did I just. What did I just do? Uh Okay. I just did that earlier. <laughs> I was fixing these guys um entrances. Okay. Keep driving to Calvary. You know what? Hold on, let me see something. Alright. Time for a road trip game. If you could face anyone who trained in Calgary in a dream match, who would it be? Isn't it a little early for road trip games? We still have like 2,000 miles to go. Come on, Damn. I'll get you started with some options. How about Bret Hart, Jake the Snake, or Rowdy Roddy Piper? 
Hmm. Well, I was thinking about Bret Hart. I mean, that's the most easiest. That would dungeon. be so cool to face a legend like that. Could you imagine? Hmm. Uh oh. Uh oh. That one war. That one is war theme song. Bret Hart vs. Trey Kent. Here we go. Here we go. So when can we go back to the actual present for once? Enough with these flashbacks, but still. Uh oh, I gotta do this. Hey, they don't got the Battle Scars theme song no more, so screw it. It's only for entrances, that's all. What? Whoa, 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 St. Louis, Missouri. I put Brooklyn, New York. What the hell? Oh my goodness. So what is the point of putting where I'm from before playing my career? <laughs> oh my God. You've got to be kidding me. I feel like I already fought Brett the Hitman Hart in 2K19. I think I did. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I'm just doing the songs because I, I, I like hearing the songs. Instead of this darn one earpiece that I got. Let's go. So you know when you're on a long drive to the next town and to pass the time, you start coming up with dreams. Oh! Oh, for God's sakes, I know what to do. Well, these two facing each other is exactly that. These are certainly two of the top names to ever pass through the great white north. When I'm on a long drive, I'm mostly just thinking about how grateful I am to be Byron the Free at the time. Ah, uh, you know you miss me. Not a chance. Into the tie-up they go, but who's going to end up with the upper hand? Oh, for God's sake, Michael Cole, that was a late reaction about the about the Cobb L tire. Oh, put me over the top rope. Look at these two giving it their all. There's absolutely no quit. That's supposed to be a counter, damn it. That's supposed to be a counter. Bam, suplex. Did he just say back suplex? Anyway, let's just carry on. Bam, what a slam. Uh oh. Look at this. The hitman is. What? It didn't even show me the triangle. What? What in the world? Alright, it doesn't matter if I win by pinfall submission. It doesn't matter if I lose too. This is just a imagination. Oh god. There we go. You know, watching Bret Hart in action here, just a reminder that he may yeah, be well, the greatest up. technical wrestler of all time. How do you counter that kind of dominance? If you want to beat the hitman, you need to use... Of course, counter knee strike. And a close one. If he's able to lock you up, it's all over. Bret wants to take... Well, I can't reverse. ...as much as possible where he can maintain complete control. As his opponent, you can't let him trap you. He's not freaking buff. Oh, 
don't know if he's trying to look at the corner. Oh, yeah, he is. Uh, generic moves at the corner, man. That got to change. Oh. Tough spot to be in. Oh. What? That was nasty. So precise. No, you're not. No, you're not. Gets it with a count. Oh, come on. Is it Brett winning, yo? Yo, come on. What is the freaking triangle? Reverse. Like, seriously? Now you give it to me, but you couldn't give it to me while I'm standing up? This is ridiculous. I know I got no reverses anyway, so here we go. Come on. There we go. Got him. Go for it. Got him. What the hell? Ah, oh, come on, Brett. God damn it. All these rollouts. Right? Aha, got him. fun my goodness Superstar. It's the same thing, so doesn't matter. All right, next scene. Even though it would have been better if I cut these loading screens off, but for some reason I just want to keep the loading screen for a bit. Oh, excuse me. Who? Doss is online. He just got online just now. Oh, what the hell? <sighs> this is it. The home of the famous dungeon. I swear, I can almost hear the wrestlers of the past groaning in pain. <laughs> That's my stomach. For the past two days, I've had nothing but moose jerky, maple puffs, and poutine. Yikes. Poutine. Look, I just want to say, I know I've been a little skeptical, but now that we're here, 
I can see us doing this. I mean, once Bret Hart hears how far we drove, he's gonna have no choice but to welcome us right in for training. So, thanks for pushing me on this. Of course. Well, here we go. <sighs> hey there. I bet you're here for Bret Hart, eh? Uh, hello. Uh, and yes, he's going to train us to be wrestlers. Eh? I'm not sure I'm using that correctly. <laughs> <laughs> is Brett home right now? He is. Hang on a sec. Oh my Brett, god. Brett, two lovely people are here for wrestling training. He'll be right down. I'm sure he's just putting his tights on, gelling up his hair, finding his sunglasses. He's got to look the part, you know. Of course. So are you Brett's housekeeper? Okay, seriously, guys? I'm messing with you. So Brett's not home? No, and he hasn't been for years. The hearts don't live here anymore. But you said... This kind of thing happens like once a month. And I like to have a little fun when I break the news. How is that fun? We just spent three days driving here. And I gave myself severe stomach issues. At this point, we'd settle for one of the more obscure Hart brothers or even a distant cousin. That's right. Like I said, none of them are here. You seem like nice kids. Stupid, but nice. Oh! And next time, do some research before you decide to drive all the way up here. Damn. Jeez. So much for Canadian hospitality. I thought you said you checked all this out online. I did. I mean, I searched for dungeon and wrestling, and then some really weird stuff came up, and I kind of got sidetracked. Point being, don't look at my browser history. But hey, we came all the way here. We should at least oh, get a no. picture. I know what he meant by that. <laughs> eh, can we do another one? I was making a weird face, probably on account of the stomach pain. Maybe you were right about us trying to become wrestlers. We've already failed at the first thing on our list. And maybe we're not cut out for this. Hey, wait, we can't just give up that easily. I have an idea! Okay. Well, that didn't go so well. Oh my. This is something else, folks. I ain't gonna lie to you, this is my career mode so far. It's pretty good. It's pretty good so far. So we all know we got a long way. So you drove all the way to Calgary thinking you were gonna train with Bret Hart? I've done some stupid stuff in my life, but that takes the cake. <laughs> it wasn't our finest moment. <laughs> But since I had a dad who only looked at the rewards section on the credit card bill, we were able to stay in Calgary and learn from a former wrestler who, at least according to him, trained with the hearts back in the day. I think he just ran next to one on a treadmill once. So that's how you guys hooked up with Riley Flash. Yeah. After striking out at the dungeon, it was kind of our only option. Even though Riley can be a bit much sometimes, he gave us the foundation we needed to get here today. He also gave us ringworm with his dirty mats, but that's a... Whole other story. Oh God! Mm. I'm guessing the loaded screen is Riley Flash. If I'm right, because I don't know. That could be him right there. It does look like he is from the A's. So, you sitting on the turnbuckle of the ring. It's not torture if you're paying for it. Next tag team match, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Josie Jane, El Mongo Jr. El Mongo, what the hell? I pressed a freaking triangle. What the? Oh my goodness. Look like a fake version of Molly Holly from 2004. If I'm right. Yo, what type of freaking max you? It's all dusty. Yeah, the freaking surroundings. See duct tape. Oh, 
Oh, she doesn't have a second rope? What the hell? I just noticed they're wearing the same pants, different color. Uh oh. Nope. Oh no. Oh god. Here we go. Oh! Jeez! Shotgun drop kick. And she's not staying down. Are you serious right now? And yes. For any final time, it's a hot flyer. Just so you know. Oh! Yo, the hit detection? It is off, yo. Including the reverse. I was about to tag freaking Trey for no reason. No! My goodness. Bit of a powerhouse, too, I see. Yeah, she's close to red. She's close to red. What the hell? She just did the angle slam. Whoa. Oh. Okay. All right. Oh, oh. There we go. Slam. Tagging in Trey. All right. Oh! Oh my God! <laughs> Fucking almost bust their ass. This is not even paying attention. Oh my goodness! Look at that sleeper hold already. Get your feet up on the turnbuckle. Push off and roll backwards. You can pin him like that. Oh no! Oh no, this is a typical Trey can't fuck up. Did he tap? I guess so. But it was training anyway. It's all right. so. Yeah, you did good. You did good. Catch your breath. We'll get him next time, all right? You good? Mm -mm -mm. Damn. I'm sorry, I'm just into the song. So freaking woman's rapping in my ear. What the hell? It ain't coming to see for I'll tell you that. Guys, come here. We need to talk. Oh. That does not sound good. Is it about your disgusting ring mat? Because I feel like it's making me itch all over. Hey, what was that for? For playing to an imaginary crowd. It cost you the match. Red, great job. Keep it up. Remind me why I show up here every day to get tortured? That's not torture if you're paying for it. <laughs> now, what I didn't tell you was that match it's right was actually behind a That's trial. Funny part. For what? Is WWE coming to town? Not quite. It was a tryout for the local Winterfest that's coming up. The organizers asked me to put on a wrestling event. That's great. Who are we going to face? I wouldn't mind a rematch against those two. Slow down. After what I just saw, only one of you was ready for their first official match. Sorry, Red. You'll get your chance soon. Actually, uh, is Red. Red's the one who's ready, not you, doughhead. What? When it comes to in-ring ability, Red's got you beat by a kilometer. Isn't that less than a mile? Oh, thanks for the conversion, Albert Asswipe. Bottom line, you're too focused on the entertainment side of things. 
Well, maybe you weren't focused enough on the entertainment side of things. Oh, Didn't God, you only appear in WWE like three times? Uh, four, if you count the time I helped carry Macho Man to the ring on his fancy chair gimmick. You mean a sedan? No, it was a chair, not a car. Either way, I was in WWE four more times than you'll ever be. Damn. I'll make it there someday. It's on our list. Oh, yeah, and someday I'm gonna poop golden nuggets. Oh, no offense, Red. Whatever. You'll see. Congrats on getting your first match. You know I'll be there cheering you on. Thanks. I know. Uh, speaking of cheering her on, since you like running your mouth so much, you can accompany her to the ring as a manager. That actually might be a better fit for you long term. Damn. A manager? That's not what I'm here for. You'll figure this out. I know it. Oh, one more thing. I need to know what to call you so they can advertise the event. That's easy. I'm sticking with Red. Kids started calling me that in high school because of my temper, but I'm gonna turn it into something positive. Okay. Man, what about you? Sticking with Denver? Mm, I don't know. Sounds too regional. And Omli. I know. How about uh, Albert Asswipe? Nah. Carl Botch? On account of all the moves you botch? Oh my god. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> How about I pay tribute to my wonderful trainer and call myself Riley Flash Jr.? Oh, that ain't happening. Do you have any other nicknames? Trey! No, no, don't listen to her. I kind of like that. And you can spell it T-R-E, so it's kind of like three in Spanish, as in getting a three count to win a match. Which probably won't happen very often for you, but you get it, right? Yeah, I get it. Great. Then Trey it is. Thanks a lot. No problem, Trey. And hey, I just realized we can cross something off our list. Come up with awesome wrestling names. I don't know about the awesome part. Hmm. Damn. That dude flashes. Roasting the hell out of me. Botches and all that type of stuff. Ass wipe. Like, my character is, my character is a smart ass. Well, at least my name is in the game. <laughs> Thank God, right? Oh, man. Well, anyway, folks, that is it for episode two of WWE 2K20, my career. Stay tuned for episode three later on today. And ladies and gentlemen, sorry for that weird random ending of what I was saying. But stay tuned. Give a like, comment, subscribe if you're new. Get ready because TK Gaming is here to stay. So ladies and gentlemen, I will see you guys for episode three.